Radically channel. In today Python tutorial number 9, we will be exploring the concept of condition. Condition in Python allows us to control the flow of a program based on specific criteria. Uh, let's uh, dive into the important aspect of programming. Uh, as you can see, uh, uh, please pause the video if you want to note uh, all of these. So to begin, uh, let's grab the concept of uh, comparison operator in Python. Uh, this operator include uh, equal to less than greater than less than equal to or not equal to etc. They enable us to compare values and make decision in our program. Uh, so let's do a simple example here. As you can see in the output section. And uh, don't worry about the code, I will upload the code on my GitHub and the link will be in the description below. So let's see the output, as you can see here. Uh, moving on, we will understand if else statement. This statement helps us uh, execute different block of code based on whether a given condition is true or false. As you can see, um, and let me tell you one thing: indentation play a crucial role in defining code block within this statement. So let's execute these codes. As you can see here, Um, as you know, in condition statement, indentation matter the most. Um, and let's apply our knowledge with a practical example.
And you know, uh, here we in this uh, simple example, we will create a grading system based on user input marks. And this example will showcase how condition can be used uh, to determine different grades. So let's see. As you can see, uh, the intern number eleven is F. And the insert number 90 uh, got a great uh, so now let's talk about uh, logical operator here uh, as you know logical operator all about and or not uh, as you know and or not are powerful tool for combining condition uh, they allow us to create more complex evaluation by combining multiple statement understanding how to use this operator and hence our ability to express interact uh, program logic and uh, you know and return true if both statements are true and uh, or return true if one statement are true and not uh, reverse the result and return false if the result is true uh, for example uh, 
uh, we'll do a simple example here In this statement, uh, we will check uh, if both statements are true, then it will print this. Uh, if you use uh, if here then we, it will check all of them if you use else if then it will check first and then second then third then fourth and then fifth um, so let's see the output As you can see, Let's give him a proper look. Now let's see again. As you can see, the third statement are true. So no need to execute the fourth and fifth statement. If you use if here, then it will check every one. That's why we are using else if. Every statement, if you use if. Now let's see again. As you can see. And uh, let me tell you one thing, I will upload a basic tutorial on if else, uh, basic project in Python with if else soon, so don't worry about that. And let me tell you one thing, the next tutorial will be about loops, so don't miss that, 
as we conclude today tutorial on condition remember to like share and subscribe if you found this video helpful in our upcoming tutorial number 10 we will dive into fascinating world of loops so stay tuned for more exciting pattern content thank you for joining us on the sadically channel and until next time happy coding thank you so much for watching this video So let's check the output section here again. Thank you so much for watching this video.